Hi everybody, we're still on Madeline Island. Uh, we're out here at Big Bay State Park and we're gonna take a walk up to some very dramatic trail. See the woods behind us, but Lake Superior isn't far and then we're gonna take a trail that follows Lake Superior. You're gonna see some dramatic scenery of Lake Superior. Right here at the entrance to the trail. There's some bathrooms off to the side here. But you can see we're going to go through some pretty heavily wooded area for just a little bit. And then we're going to break out into by the by the water. Now we're coming up here on the water. And this is what they call the point. It used to be called Eagle's Point, the Eagle's Nest. Um, there are a lot of eagles here. But uh, they've changed the name because the eagle's nest itself isn't here anymore, right here at the point. Really? Yeah. Could be. Yes. some gorgeous cliffs. Yeah. We're here by Big Bay Town Park here now, which actually joins together with Big Bay State Park. And this is a way to, to come down and see a little bit different scenery. The beach, the beach is for both parks. And we're gonna see a lagoon with a bridge that uh, has been here for many years, even though, it, even though it's a wooden bridge, so it's been reconstructed several times over the years. But uh, it's, you're going to see what a beautiful park this is, too. We're entering the Big Bay Town Park, and we're going down here by the lagoon to start with. No lifeguard on duty, no diving or jumping from bridge. See the people canoeing out there. Yeah. Oh. And this is the bridge I was talking about. It's been rebuilt uh, several times over the years since yeah. I've been a kid. Wood doesn't last forever.
Muskrat? I don't know what muskrat on the edge of the water. Crawling. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it's a we some kind of weasel. See that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It is. It's it's not a muskrat. No, it's not a muskrat. It's like a weasel or a muskrat. Yeah. I don't know how it's well they can man. see it, but uh, when I heard you first talk about it, I thought I thought it must be a muskrat. But something coming. That is so And that is the beach out on Lake Superior. And you can see you can rent kayaks down here. Uh, probably canoes too. At least they used to have canoes. Yeah, I see some canoes back over there. both canoes and kayaks. And that's for use mainly out in here in the lagoon area. But this is Big Bay Beach. Yeah. Beautiful beach, but the water is cold. I don't know how many of you are familiar with swimming in Lake Superior, but it's not to be done when you when you get older. I used to swim in it as a boy, and until my kids uh, were old enough, you know that they didn't we didn't go swimming with them. I used to go in the water too, but. Uh, I haven't in quite a few years. The beach goes down, it connects with Big Bay State Park and it and it's all one one beach, both the town park and the state park. The point out there is where we were hiking around the uh, sand cliffs. And you can see some more of the cliffs over this way too. What do you think? Beautiful area. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And this is the big lake they call Gitchigumi. Back to Water Island Station we came with provisions and mail. Four o'clock, the wind commenced, the blue a living gale. We lit the lamp at sunset, framed the clock of rain. Scrubbing with Brian on the lantern glass to remove the angry sea. Our dock was driven to the boulder. Talk we had to show. So splendid was Superior Spirit 25.